Behold, it's Bisexual Awareness Week. Not only do I put the bi in biological anthropology, I'm also bisexual! Yay! And I wanted to take this week to break down some misconceptions about bisexuality and bisexuals. First, there are those folks that don't think bisexuality is even real, especially in men. Like they haven't committed to being fully gay yet and bisexuality is just a beard. Even some other members of the LBGTQ community have a hard time believing that bisexual men exist. But they do. When it comes to bisexual ladies, you often hear the, oh, <laughs> it was a phase. You know how those sorority girls can be. If bisexuality is a phase, this has been the longest phase of my life. Just 41 years of being an equal opportunity gender lover. There's also the cockamamie idea that women are with other women to entice the male gaze. What? Ew. No. Oh my god, yeah, I just make out with girls so guys find us sexy. What the f*** here? Bisexuality? is real. Get used to it. So let's kiss that bi erasure adieu and show a little respect for bisexuals. I love that song. Misconception number two. If a bisexual person is dating somebody of the opposite sex, they're no longer bisexual. What? No, that's not how it works. And a bisexual person can go their whole life without really dating somebody of the same sex and still be bisexual. And we have to take into consideration that some folks are not in a safe situation to practice bisexuality or even be open. That doesn't make them any less part of the LBGTQ community. No need to gay keep. Get it? It's like gatekeep, but gay. Never mind. Misconception number three. Bisexuals are only attracted to two genders. Oh no. They're attracted to two or more genders. Again, I like to think of myself as an equal opportunity gender lover. Gender loving care. I'll work on that. Essentially, if somebody's freaking awesome, huh, bring it. So there you have it. Those are some misconceptions. I'll be coming back with more and my favorite bisexual animals. Happy Bi-Awareness Week!